Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 99 Gaming doing a video for Empires and Allies, and this is called Angry Raids, January 26, 2016. So the purpose of uh, these videos is just to work on the technique without scouting. So I'm just going to go through, pick a headquarter level 17 and below, and just uh, very impromptu, nothing scripted. Uh, you guys will see real time uh, my raid, uh, good things, bad things, mistakes that are going to happen. But overall, we'll see uh, what the talent level is. So let's get this thing going and you guys can uh, be the judge of this video. So look for an opponent and the first thing that we're going to do is just take a quick look at headquarter. Anything above level 17 is off limits at this point. That is 17 so we're going with it. So You can see we're just hitting the button. Nothing more, nothing less. So who knows whether it be a 1 star, 2 star, 3 star. I may have to change my attack up a little bit. He's got some nice walls on the outside. So do you want to go after the headquarter or at least guarantee a 50%? So we got a rail gun up near the top. I think I'm going to, you know what? We're going to go in and just hit this rail gun. Just enough juice to get that down. All right, so we got a little bit left over here. We're going to go ahead and drop here. I'm assuming there's going to be a trap around here somewhere. All right, we're going to go ahead in here, and I want to drop a flare and get all these guys going in this direction. Let's shut some of this stuff down. Alright, we're going to spam heal. Now I'm going headquarter only right now just to get the cheap win. And looks like we're having enough to get the headquarter. And now anything addition is just a bonus. This is not the best uh, setup, but we can get 50%, we can get out here with two stars. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and drop some reinforcements here just to tag a few of these on the outside. Alright, we got the two star guaranteed. So what we want to do now is shut a few things down and we can get some resources. We're in pretty good shape up top. I'm going to go ahead and speed burst there. All right, now we can start picking off some resources here once we get on the outside right. One more fixture, and we're going to come. Uh, we're going to go to the south here along this wall. Go ahead and heal up. Get everybody back in good shape. Well, the stealth in the middle has had. Uh, he's got some lockdown going for a little bit. I don't know if we're going to have enough time to actually get to 100%. But you know what? Let's go ahead and drop an A-10 over here so we can get this artillery weakened up pretty well. It's like their defense. They've only got a couple left. We can lock down this disco ball. Yeah, we're not going to have enough time to get everything down. You know what? I'll take it. We got off to a rocky start there. A couple of traps down at the bottom. And we got a good portion of their resources anyway. If we could get one more speed burst, we could... Uh... Let's drop. Let's try to get a little extra steel right here at the end. We got timed. So, um, you know, there you saw a technique. We just went straight for the middle. I didn't know how, how hard they were going to hit from the outside, and I knew they had several traps. But overall, you know what? Let's take a look and see what we got out of that. Pretty good resources, and we hit a higher opponent. Going to cost us a little bit to uh, replenish that. And I think if I had been just a little bit faster, 91,000 fuel. But that's probably the extent of it. That's a headquarter level 17. And we're still in pretty good shape. So let's go ahead and... You know, here's a little trick. We got these things healing on the outside, so it's just a matter of how much gold I want to spend in order to get this. Obviously, we're not going to wait the whole seven minutes, but we do have these boosted on the outside. But I think it's going to drop relatively fast here. And you guys wanted to see longer videos, so here you go. 
All right, so you know what? At 12, I'm going to go ahead and go with it. Let's get the next opponent, and who knows what we're going to get. Like I said before, we're not scouting. We're just going right after it. Ooh, headquarter 20. We will skip that. Sorry, I'm not doing headquarter level 20 at my current headquarter level. That's 16. We definitely will take you. All right, so he's got weak walls. Not a problem there. Let's go ahead. Like I said before, I'm not scouting. We're going to take down the metal rain in the middle. Let's just get some damage going over here. Yeah, I'm going to pop an A10 here, see if we can take a couple of those down. We did. Perfect. And this looks like a good entry point for us. We got no alliance reinforcements this battle. But you know what? We're not going to need them because we're going to have some hard hitting rangers. Let's go ahead and we're going to heal. You guys can see a little bit of my strategy too. So we're going to heal. And then once we get in position up here, we're going to speed burst. Trying to get that funnel. And let's go ahead and shut down some stuff here in the middle. Pop a secondary heal. We got some healing drones going on. That's all good because you know what? We're just going to shut it down again. I don't like that Patriot missile shooting at us. I'm going to take that out of the way. Let's speed burst again all the way through this headquarter. And we're going to go ahead and heal. And we're in a great spot now. You know what? We're just going to speed burst again up near the top. He's got a little bit of a trap down at the bottom. But we've killed all his defense. The trap down at the bottom really serves no purpose whatsoever. That's just a terrible place for him to place those stealth tanks. Because you do want your stealth tanks to at least be somewhere close to your defenses. And you can see pretty easy three star there. Sorry, Mari. 22 and 2. Big difference in that battle from the previous battle. Maybe we'll get my mojo back. All right, so uh, let's do it one more time. Let's 30,000, not a big deal. And six gold, let's go and pay the six gold to rush through this. And here we go, let's do this one more time. And we got another 16, done. All right, so decent walls there. I mean, sorry, non-decent walls. Pretty weak. All right, it's a whole bunch of stuff. Let's see, if I were a person trying to trick somebody, where would I be? I think he probably works on the south a little bit, so I'm going to come in from the west. This looks like an unoccupied area. We'll go ahead and shut down your ion cannon, sir. And now we will speed burst all the way through to your ion cannon. And we will A-10 your ion cannon to make sure it doesn't come back online. Heal up any damage that we took here. There's his trap. His trap was probably in the south and he had them rotating, just sort of making their way over. So no problems whatsoever with that. Now I want to get rid of this disco ball in the middle. So what we're going to do is just wait for an EMP. I could speed burst through all that, but one more hit and I can EMP all this stuff in the middle. So disco ball shut down. And now we can just sort of make our way to the core. See if I can take down this other disco ball from the back. Nope. Not quite enough juice there. That's okay. We'll be there before you know it. And let's see. You know what? We're going to go ahead and just heal up in the middle because i got the stealth tank that can sort of lock stuff down. And this is why this comp is is so powerful. It's mostly rangers, but those three, the three stealth tanks just basically work as three more EMPs. Let's go ahead and rush through this stuff just to get it over with. I'm not sure if he's got another trap, but we'll drop an A-10 here just in case we need to catch a little bit of his stealth. Nope, we're good to go. So that is it. And so you saw the first raid was level 17, and... I probably gave him a little bit too much credit because I went straight to the core and lost a lot of troops there. If I'd have been a little bit more meticulous, I may have had a little bit more time to get the uh, three stars there. But the 16s were absolutely no problem at all. 
So this is a series I'm going to throw together just so you guys can see some different bases. Uh, my technique is probably not going to vary a whole lot with this because I'm going to stick with the Ranger uh, uh, Stealth Tank format. It's been working really well for me. But thanks everyone for watching. I know it's been a while since I've gotten some uh, real serious raid videos and they're only going to improve. I'm going to work on my metal count a little bit more so you guys stop giving me so much flack. My name is Killshot. This is called Angry Raids, January 26, 2016. Leave your comments below and give this video a thumbs up. Talk to you soon. Peace.